My name is Aikunje Aikunje John. I'm a farmer. I grow cassava and cocoa. I'm 33 years of age. I grew here in Buviongo, at the east province of Mount Cameroon National Park. I enjoy the village. It's a nice place for me. If I also go to the city, my village will not grow up. So I need to be in the village. I'm struggling to do one or two things to encourage people to come and sit with me in my village. In the, in the village, I'm the president of the cassava group. I'm the development president. So I'm struggling to assist all this community to grow up the village. Yes, I cultivate cocoa and cassava, but I mostly concentrate on cassava. We harvest cocoa once a year, but cassava, we harvest cassava throughout. You see that somebody's uh, producing cocoa cannot compare with somebody's producing cassava. Cassava has less level, cocoa has high level. So you see that the advantage mostly goes on cassava. And we eat cassava, we can't eat cocoa. When I get my farm in the morning, if today my program is to prepare how we eat watafufu in four days' time, so I will take my bike in the morning, I climb on top of my bike direct to my farm. The area of this farm is four hectares of land. All, all along, Mankamaro National Park trains me for cassava multiplication. During harvesting, I supply the curtains to everybody. So the whole community now has improved variety. And I train them how to plant, even how to, to nest cassava stems, and even about the soil fertility, how we're going to do before preparing our land. See, here in Mount Cameroon area, we have a volcanic soil, and our soil is very, very rich. So we never use fertilizer to plant our crops. Years upon years, from the day I was born, I meet my parents are planting using the soil with no fertilizer right up to date. And I harvest, I carry it, I come to the house, I peel. From the peeling, I wash it, I soak it in a basin or a bucket or a drum. Three days, it gets off, I remove it and sift it. After sifting it, I put it in a bag. I put it on the basin, I put it inside the pot. From there, my wife will prepare it. We eat. There is so much cassava in Boviongo continuously, and we never short food for cassava in this village. Through cassava, my life is increased. Even my children are going to school. I use money from cassava to sponsor them. So, and I consume cassava. I had no problem in life concerning cassava. Cassava sustains me a lot.